So we're here at uh, Ployer, and uh, who are you? Hi everyone, uh, this is Brian from Ployer. I'm in charge of the, the business of the overseas market. So Ployer is doing tablets? Yeah, sure. For um, how long? Uh, for tablets already for five years. So you're quite a, a specialist in tablets, right? You mm -hmm. do lots of different tablets. Yes, right. And selling big quantities, right? Can, can you give a background of the company? How, uh, mm -hmm. what's, what's been going on? Recently? Okay. We employer, Shenzhen employer electronics company Nimte. Uh, we founded in 2007. Uh, it's okay? Yeah. yeah. Uh, we also have some introduction of our company. Uh, we founded in 2007 and the beginning is for some basic electronics products, MP3, MP4, GPS navigators. And from 2010, we moved to the tablets and only for tablets. Uh, currently, for uh, our factories, we uh, totally have uh, 7, 000, uh, sorry, uh, 700 employees. Uh, including our workers, our other uh, workmates uh, in different departments, and also the factory have uh, 10,000 uh, square meters and uh, 16 um, production lines. Each monthly uh, uh, pro production capacity is uh, mm, 300,000 pieces per month. 300,000, that sounds uh -huh. like uh, 3.6 million per year. Yeah. So we're talking about uh, quite big quantities. Mm -hmm. And, but you, you're still mostly selling in China? Yeah. Most of your sales go to Chinese market? Mm -hmm. Because uh, currently for our market, um, based on uh, our own field and our uh, advantage is uh, the sales in local market. We also have the bigger brand in China. And for overseas, we also sell in different uh, cooperation methods. One part is selling directly with our own brand, another part is uh, to do service, uh, supply the OEM service with our customers. So mo how much of it is your brand, how much of it is uh, uh, customer ODM mm, business? Currently it's 50% uh, and 50%. 50-50? Yeah. So these are some of the latest Allgunner tablets you have? Yeah. So have, uh, which one do you have here? Mm -hmm. What is we this? We have a uh, different size. Firstly for the 7 inch. Yeah. yeah. At the beginning the 7 inch like this kind of style. So this is basic 7 inch, right? Yeah, basic 7 inch normal design. And we, uh, we can look around. Yeah, it's uh, the back cover. So is this the one that you are manufacturing today? Mm-hmm, yes. And so this is around 35? Yeah. All right. And what is this one? Uh-huh. This is a new design and based on the current, uh, the basic one, but just change, make it a little better design. You can compare this. So more narrow and a yeah. little bit better display? Yes. Uh, better uh, visibility on the display, right? Yes. Uh, so this is kind of like an IPS or not? Mm-hmm. Also, I currently also have the two options, one with the HD, another is for the IPS. So is this a little bit more expensive? Yep, something like uh, $2 more or less. Just $2 more, and uh, how long is the battery life on these kind of tablets? Uh, battery life, uh, 3.5 hours. And now, minimum is all when A33, right? Yes. You don't do A23 anymore, only A33. Uh, actually, this two design, original design is based on the A23, but uh, the, after the quad core A33 came out, we replaced all to this because the quad core was much more better uh, the performance and also the competitive price. And uh, also better longer battery life and uh, yeah. it was easy, it's pin to pin compatible. It's easy yes. for the PCB design to be yeah, so upgraded, right? Right. And so here, what okay. is this? Uh, this one we have a, another new design. It's uh, the 8 inch IPS, 1 to 80 and 800 for the resolution. And the first step we produce for Honda. And I will show you. All right. And for, o, uh, for OEM service in the overseas market, we also can produce this one. Nice. So is there a price for that? Or uh, price something like uh, the retail price, um, something like 100 US dollar. So it's better than the iPad mini. Yeah. It's a thin bezel. It's nice. Mm -hmm. Good display and uh, stable. Yeah. And what kind of all winner inside? Uh, it's also the A33. All right, so this is entry level right there. Yeah. So, how about this? Uh huh. And then we move to the. Ah, uh, oh, sorry. We, we can talk about the nine inch first. The nine inch. Uh, we make the family design with a seven inch. Uh, we can check the back cover. It is a uh, much more similar, similar, just different size. Yeah. So this is the entry level. Yeah, nine entry inch. level for nine inch. How entry? How much it cost? Maybe. Something like uh, less than fifty US dollar. Less than 50, you get a 9-inch. Yeah. Uh, 
and uh, retailing all over China and into yeah. different countries too. Yes. This is nice display, mm -hmm. stable, nice. Yes. But the basic resolution, right? Yeah, this is the basic one. And I also have the option to view with the HD. And all of this, potentially, in the next two, three weeks, very soon, maybe all of it is Android 5. Yeah. Everything that's all on the A33 mm -hmm. can be Android 5. Yeah, I see so. All right. How about okay. this one? And then move to the 9.7 inch. 9.7 inch, we have a very good design. is with an IPS screen. Yeah, and uh, much more slim with a metal case. Can we see how uh -huh. slim? Yeah. Yeah. Slim like this. Yes. So, uh, and employer the, brand. Yeah, this is employer brand. All right. What mm -hmm. is the price for that one? This one is uh, uh, something like uh, 80 US dollar. So it's 1024 by 768. Uh, no, this one is resolu uh, resolution. It's 1024 and 768. But we also have another option. We change it to the Retina screen. 2048. Uh, Retina work with H33? Yeah. So this is A33 with, uh, is it IPS or what? IPS. And you said the price was? Uh, something like the 80 US dollar. So 80 US dollar, you get something It's as thin as the iPad Air or no? Yeah. So this this is probably very popular, no? Mm -hmm. Very popular. Very popular. Yeah. You sell hundreds of Ks. Mm -hmm. Hundreds of thousand. Yeah. What is this one? Ah, uh huh. This one is a ten point one inch with IPS. We make some change and special UI and my comes. So let's see. It's uh yeah. Its resolution is one uh, one two eighty and eight hundred IPS. So this is a twelve eighty eight hundred. Yes. Lawyer brand mm -hmm. and uh, what is CPU? Uh, currently, is, uh, it is A31s because uh, the customer needed with HDMI connectors and the HDMI jack. So you could also do A33. Yeah, and uh, another design we make this is also the 10 inch with a layer bezel design. All right. Mm -hmm. 10 inch narrow bezel. So yeah. it's the same uh, display size as this. Uh huh. You can check the difference. Smaller bezel. Yeah. Quite much smaller. Mm -hmm. So how much more does it cost to have a narrow bezel like this? Uh, but this one is a uh, special design for the uh, sorry for the customers uh, in the Europe because this is this kind of design and this kind of spec. We change the screen to the HD, one or twenty-four and six hundred. But the price are also very uh, competitive, less than seventy-five US dollar. All right, this is pretty cool mm -hmm. with the A thirty-three, huh? Yeah, and this is a nice touch. Good good quality uh, panel yes and potentially Android 5 also yeah very soon Android 5 huh? mm -hmm. all right so how, can you explain a bit uh, how is it to work with the old winner because you have experience with yep. like three years or what yes right uh, actually for owner we already cover with them for a long time uh, before the tablets they also the uh, the box chip right and they produce um, the processor for the mp3 mp4 players and uh, in 2010, and they are preparing something new with the Orbiner processor. The first step is the A10. And uh, from that, we also move all our products to the uh, tablet with the Orbiner processor. So for the uh, tablets, it's already uh, four to five years. So how is it possible for Orbiner to be number one? It's crazy, no? It's a crazy story. They just mm -hmm. come and they and you work with them since the beginning. Yeah. And uh, the quantity is very big. Very big, yeah. And um, at that period, as I know, there are many different processors in the market. But um, with our own experience, we still feel that the Orbiner is the best processor for the tablet, especially for the local market and for the overseas. They with very good performance and very good design for the power management and also the very good price. And it's good, the uh, stability for the yield is good. There's no yeah. like too many uh, uh, mistakes, right? Mm -hmm. Right. So it's quite stable. They it's have a good team. Stable. Yeah. Good team to work, the engineer. Mm -hmm. yeah. And so how, does that, how do you work with, together with Design House? You have Design House friends that you work together with, you get design made? Yeah. And for the, very yeah. quickly? Mm -hmm. what? For the uh, over the product, we cooperate with the Design House uh, and the iNet. And also, they are the biggest uh, agent from the Orbiner processor. So, uh, considering our three-party relationship, we can uh, make the product 
and especially some new product to the market very fast. They are considering the design uh, for ours and for the, for the design house and for the all winner. We three party cooperate very well. So how much it cost? If I have an idea, I want a new tooling, I want a mm -hmm. new something, how long time it take, how much it cost? A secret or? Um, something roughly I can, I can share some information. For the time, if design new product with a new PCB with uh, the uh, tooling uh, and the entry to, to MP, something like uh, 40 to 45 days. 40 to 45 days yes. and a good price? Including 10k, 5k, or something minimum order for new tooling, or mm, something like 5k to, to 10k. All right, mm -hmm. and uh, can be done so fast. Just one month and a half new tooling yeah. possible. Yes. All right, and you, you, people contact you from around the world, and they say we want this, and you can do it or what? Yeah, sure. All right, and you have capacity to make more. Yeah. All right. Cool. So there is. Uh, the latest player and mm -hmm. I guess uh, you already have a whole bunch of ideas for the future. You will have yeah. many new products coming out. Mm -hmm. uh, for all many products, we are still focusing on their new processor. Uh, the first one is the Octa-Core A83. This one with much more power, uh, powerful performance and higher speed, higher frequency and also can support the retina screen. So everything is okay and also for our market. Mm, uh, just what we said in the Product 9, it is already EMP for the 9.7 with retina screen. And later we also have a, uh, we'll prepare some uh, other new models with, based on different design, like um, 8 inch, 8, uh, the 10 inch, and also others, other size for it. Alright, and uh, so there it is, uh, octa-core, quad-core, mm -hmm. uh, Android 5 stable designs. Yeah.